Here's the other thing too, is when you have more kids, you realize it's another person that you have to tell the Christmas lie to. And if you're parents, you know what that is, right? You gotta look your children in the face. By the way, if you don't have kids, listen to this bullshit, okay? I have another child now that I have to look in the eyes and tell them that a made up dude, a fictional fucking character, flies through the sky in a sleigh being pulled by deer, 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 being pulled by fucking deer, okay? And one of these deer has a light bulb on its nose, cause why not, right? And then this made up dude flies through the sky and lands on the rooftops. Yeah. And he comes down the chimney, except for a while, we didn't have a chimney, okay? Yo, yeah. I had to look my children in the eyes and tell them that Santa came through the air vent in the goddamn bathroom. That's what I had to tell them. You've never lied in your life until you do this the first time. You just look them in the eyes like, yeah, Santa turns into a sugar or a mist. Yeah. And then you're like, what the fuck am I talking about? You can't believe the shit you come up with. Like, I feel like when you first tell that lie, you're like, I could kill nine people and get away with it. I could lie about anything. If these kids believe this shit, oh my God. Then, this is the best part. Then you have to tell them that this made up dude comes down in your house and brings all the presents that mommy and daddy bought you. This is bullshit, okay? After our third kid, I told my wife, I'm done. I'm done with Santa. Santa can kiss my ass. I'm done with this asshole. I'm tired of this. And my wife's like, you can't do that. You're gonna ruin it for all the other kids at school. You don't wanna do that. I don't give a shit about those kids, okay? But I wanna be a good dad, you know? I wanna be a good dad, right? So I came up with my own plan. I came up with my own Santa plan. Santa's gonna exist, okay? So next Christmas, when my kids come down, I'm like, hey kids, Merry Christmas. See this Disney princess bike? Yeah, daddy bought you this. Yes, I did. See that Avengers bike, buddy? Yeah, daddy bought you that, that's right. Oh yeah, daddy bought you these, cause daddy was working hard doing a, a show in Wheeling, West Virginia in the middle of February in an old age home on a Sunday at noon for $45 to save up for these son of a bitches. You better believe I'm getting credit for this, oh yeah. Yeah, not all shows are great shows in a theater like this. Sometimes you gotta do the shit, okay? You gotta do the real shit to save up for your kids, so I'm getting credit for these. Now, of course, my daughter, you met her, right? She's gonna be like, Daddy, Father, what about Santa? What did Santa bring? Oh, don't worry, honey. Santa brought you something. Yes, he did. Look at this. Santa brought you a 100 pack of church socks. Yes, he did. The ones that you hate that make your legs itch for an hour and a half. Yeah. Yeah, that's right. Santa brought you these church socks and Santa brought you all the Halloween candy from on top of the fridge. Yay! <laughs> Merry Christmas, Whoppers and Almond Joy from Santa, yay! See, Santa exists in my house, but my kids are gonna go to school and tell all the other kids that he's a cheap piece of shit and ruin his reputation. And let me tell you something right now, I wanna use this opportunity. If we all get on board and Santa starts bringing bullshit, we can eradicate this motherfucker forever, okay? I feel like you should be more excited, okay? I think it's a great idea. I know you're thinking, he's just telling jokes. No, think about it for a second. We can fuck this dude up, okay? It was amazing. It was amazing. That is true. That is true.